Iraq. You know, I'm listening. I, I don't want to embarrass him because he's not a television what? general. I'll end up ruining him. Television He'll probably general. come out with a bad statement about me because he was told to. But uh, we had a general. I flew in and I landed. This is fu this this seriously. This is really making me upset. You think about the world and all the shit going on. You got this other fucking guy. They can't fucking do nothing. He's the worst guy to have. It's like we're being punished for for being alive. How are you gonna? And I can't believe it. It's very depressing. Listen to this guy. This guy had he had his balls. Number one. At night, every window was dark. Because they thought it would be, this is on Air Force One. I said, isn't that terrible? The lights were all off. They pulled down the shades. The plane was entirely black. They couldn't see it. And I said, isn't that incredible? We've spent trillions of dollars in the Middle East and we can't even land Air Force One with the lights on, right? But I landed and it was an incredible experience. I got to meet a lot of great, real people, real soldiers, real generals, real officers. We have great generals. Well, and what, what are they they greeted me at the airplane, ball? immediately you know whisked me inside. I'm saying, you mean with all the money we spent? States, are you going to elect one of these other assholes? Are you going to reinstate this son of a bitch if he even stays alive? And I know, I used to not even like to talk about the presidents like that. He's a son of a fucking bitch. He is a bitch. I don't like it. It's fu it's very depressing. This is very depressing. It's making me sad. This is supposed to be the president. This is the guy who won. Generals that could star in any movie, they had that quality. And the sergeant who was unbelievable could have been a movie star. I said, you know... You're a good-looking guy. You're a tough guy. Yes, sir. But I met General. I said, uh, General Kane, what's your first name? Raisin, sir. Raisin. I said, you mean like a raisin? Yes, sir. I said, you mean your name is General Raisin Kane? I love you, General. I'm, that's you're what I'm looking for. I'm looking for that. And I said, so, General, they say it's going to take two years, General, to get rid of the ISIS caliphate in Iraq, Syria. And do you agree with that? No, sir. <laughs> I said, you don't. Well, my Washington television general said two years, and they said we won't be able to do it in that. I disagree, sir. They said, how long will it take? Sir, we can do it in four weeks, maybe less, sir. I said, wait a minute, general. Explain this to me. Well, sir, they would come here, and they're of a higher rank. I said, did you ever tell them what you have in mind? No, sir, that wasn't my job. I'm a general. I was at a lower rank. They tell me, sir. They didn't ask. I'm not supposed to do that, sir. I'd like to, and I wanted to, but I couldn't. I said, so you did a plan that they didn't want, right? That's uh, what you want to do now. He said, yes, sir. It's very easy. I said, when you say four weeks, I said, yes, sir. Four weeks, and you know what? We're going to have time left yeah, over, sir. I said, so what's different? They say two years, and you won't do it. You say four weeks, and you're going to have time left over. What's the difference? Sir, we'll hit them from five different locations. We'll hit them from the left. We'll hit them from the right. We'll hit them down the middle. We'll be launching from Syria, from Iraq, and from all over. Sir, they only wanted us to fly from this big Air Force base that we have right here from our big base. And we're very far away, and it's one location. Sir, we have many locations, and we'll hit them from every damn one of those locations. That's, that, that's, that's the guy. That's Biden. Fucking one fucking, one bullshit stroller ride to everything he does. And here we go. We had this guy. Oh no, I don't want him to be the president because you you if you don't want him to be the president, you want your country all fucked up. Fuck, I didn't pay attention to nothing he fucking did. I didn't have to. That's what I liked about him. I didn't have to worry about what he was going to do. 
Shit was doing great. Shit was nice. What the fuck is wrong with you people? You fucking Democrats, seriously. I'm not a Republican or a Democrat. I don't give a fuck about any of that. That's all dumb. But seriously, if you have to vote for one person, why, why are you going to hate on the one that can fucking do the job and hire some fucking retard, fucking clone lizard fuckhead? He's a piece of shit. Oh, you're finding out now, though. Quit fucking being stupid, people.